Today I'm going to be making Ryan Trahan a 10 million subscriber award out of pennies. So first, I need to lay out the ceram wrap. And I'm going to be making a few of these so the pennies stay together and they don't go everywhere. So I need to lay down the pennies so the head is facing the front. Time lapse in 3, 2, 1. Now I need to take tape and tape all of the pennies together so they don't fall apart. And this is one of the hardest parts because if you mess up, then you have to take the tape off and the pennies will stick to it also. Another time lapse in 3, 2, 1. Okay, now I'm going to finish by taping this together. And it looks very nice. <laughs> Floppy corner. And now, I have to do the next one. Time lapse in 3, 2, 1. Now I need to tape these pennies together. And hopefully I don't mess up. I have to get it nice and perfect. And there we go. And I messed up. Of course I did. Let me fix that. And time lapse in 3, 2, 1. Let's hope I don't mess up again. There we go. Come on. Get it perfect. And of course I messed up again. The second time. Okay, I started to draw this. You can see that there's the one cent shades, and now I'm gonna draw the Photoshop logo. So, time lapse in three, two, one, go. Now I'm going to make the top piece. So, time lapse three, two, one. Okay, so I cut out a piece of cardboard for th one of the sides of the award, so I can glue the pennies onto there. I'm using the good old Elmer's glue. Time lapse in 3, 2, 1, go! For the base, I decided it would be a big penny, so I'm going to start cutting out that right now. Now I need to measure the radius of the penny so I can figure out how much cardboard I need to go around it. And the radius is about 2.5 inches. So now all I need to do is multiply that by 4 point, I mean 3.14. And I'm just going to search this up because I don't know if I'm doing that right. And it's 15.71. Okay, so I made a penny out of some cardboard. And there's a side too. And I'm filling it with other pennies so that it can be heavy, like a penny. That's a lot of pennies. So I'm going to glue that after. But first, I'm going to glue all of the sides together. Also... None of these were supposed to be flipped over, but on this one, you can see, oh shoot, that's a dirty penny, it's this one that's flipped over, can't really tell, but it is flipped over, so now I'm going to glue these together. Okay, now I have it all glued, but there's no pennies in there, so I made a little slot to slide them in because I didn't want to glue pennies because that 
might not have been good. So I have to do all these pennies and slide them in one by one. So let's do another time lapse. Okay. There's still room for a little bit more pennies. But I was thinking maybe I could make this a piggy bank except it's not a piggy so if i put a door here and you can get the pennies out okay got a thumbtack and a pipe cleaner so if i oh if i poke a hole right here Let me try and fix that. Okay, so as I was trying to fix it, we got Ryan Trey in in the background. Yeah. I ripped it. Thanks, babe. So I'm gonna get some clear tape. Okay, I got it all back together, except for this penny that fell out. I guess I'll just put it in for the door. Let me. Now I'm gonna take the thumbtack out and get a door. Okay. So, this isn't working. Uh, I could use a rubber band, but I'm trying to get this done pretty fast. So I think I'm just going to glue it normally and fill it with more pennies. Okay, so I decided I'm gonna take some tape and then wrap it around all of these different sides, the different sides. Okay, finished. Putting the tape all around it, you can't even see it if you look far away you can't see it either on here my idea was for this piece to be kind of at an angle which means i need to use some more pennies and make an angle kind of like this well you can't see so let me do that okay i just need it to the glue to dry. Once it dries, then okay. I can put it on here. <laughs> but for now, we've got this piece that goes on top. I'm gonna type out what I want to go on it. So first, I need to measure it. Now, I'll just start typing it. Okay, so I've got these glued. So now, I'm going to need to glue it onto this. All right, now I need to make a back piece for this. We'll get back when I finish this. Okay, now I've got all the glue on. I decided, just because, so I have this written out. I'm gonna glue it here. You see there's a little opening. You can put your pennies in and then you can't get it out unless you flip it over. All right. Now, I'm going to start putting all of these pennies in, 100 pennies in one by one, so then it's a, a little heavier. All right. That pretty good now it's done finally it's not that bad if you get further away from it it looks better it's not done around it around the big giant penny gotta do that so now I have to get that color.